The United Nations Secretary General Antonio Guterres has called for $35 billion more, including $15 billion in the next three months, for the WHO's ACT Accelerator program to back vaccines, treatments and diagnostics against COVID-19. Some $3 billion has been contributed so far. Guterres told an online event calling it seed funding that was less than 10% of what the WHO wants for the program. Financial support has so far lagged uh, goals as nations or governments in including the European Union, Britain, Japan and United States reach bilateral deals for vaccines, prompting Guterres and the WHO uh, Director General uh, Tedros Adhanom Ghebreyesus to plead to nations to contribute. The ACT Accelerator is the global solution we are looking for. Now we need to make important political choices if the world is to reap its promise. First, we need a quantum leap in funding to increase the chances of a global solution to get the world moving, working, and prospering again. The three billion US dollars contributed to date has been critical as a seed funding for the startup phase of the ACT accelerator. But we now need 35 billion more to go from startup to scale up and impact. Third, we need greater trust. For any vaccine to work, the majority of men, women and children across the globe need to be willing to accept it. It is now our task to reinforce this momentum, to facilitate the ACT Accelerator's work and to show to the partners involved that they deserve our support. Through the ACT Accelerator, the world can and will invest in common solutions and common goals common goods that will save lives and ensure safety for all of us. Between now and the end of the year, we have a limited window of opportunity to scale up the ACT Accelerator and fully enable the equitable allocation framework. Currently, the ACT Accelerator is supporting research into promising uh, vaccines, therapeutics and diagnostics but we need to rapidly scale up our clinical trials, manufacturing, licensing, and regulation capacity so that these products can get to people and start saving lives.